So who knows, this is about my 10th uh, attempt at making this video because a uh, little screen keeps popping up on the phone and cutting the camera off um, saying uh, action required and uh, man I have spent the entire evening watching YouTube videos trying to figure out how to cut it off. The good news is I'm phone's a lot more secure. Um, I found out a lot. Uh, I didn't know that apps could change the settings on your phone. I always wondered why, you know, I'm going like, man, didn't I cut this off, you know? And the next thing you know, it's back on. Uh, so when you apply updates, uh, if, it, if you allow the app to uh, change your settings, it'll just go in and change the settings. Won't even ask you. I mean, these phones are just unfreaking believable um, So let's get the political talk out of the way first. Um, you know you have a trader uh, it, traders in the White House um, so uh, and that's been admitted now. I, I mean yesterday it was just speculative. Uh, is anything going to be done about it? Looks like not. You know you have an authoritarian government now. Um, the executive branch uh, they ignore the uh, legislative branch, they ignore the um, the Congress uh, and uh, those spineless uh, backboneless uh, rhinos that are uh, in Congress, they're not going to do anything about it. So I don't know what to tell you. You know, I mean, uh, when you find out that the guy um, uh, circumvented the Constitution, circumvented his, his authority, talk to, talk to an, an, a, a, well, let's just say an adversary, China, on his own, uh, bypassed uh, normal channels and is not going to pay a price for it I mean, it's it's unbelievable what's what's been happening. I mean, you you have a corrupt FBI, you got a corrupt government. Um, I guess we're just going to head down that road, and the Democrats are all for it. They're all for it. So good. We got that out of the way. I just uh, just wanted to say my piece uh, for what it's worth, and you know, it's not going to matter. Let's talk about the uh, well. So we talked about the phone. Um, so, you know, and how am I getting ready for the trip? And I know, man, it's, it's, it's everything just keeps stalling me and stalling me and stalling me. So I spent yesterday all day working on the uh, GoPro. Um, so I wanted to tell you what I found out and uh, just to educate you a little bit if you decide you want to make videos like I am, uh, hopefully on this trip. Um, the first thing, you know, that we talked about was we needed an SD card in here. Um, I got the, the, the SAN uh, SD card uh, because there's no memory. <laughs> you know, what's the, I mean, you would have thought the guy at Best Buy would have said, hey, man, you're going to need some memory with that. You know, so we so the card came in and uh, the first thing you want to do is apply the uh, updates or, you know, update the firmware and everything. And um, but, you know, and I'm watching YouTube videos and they were saying the best way to do it is install the app on your on your phone which we've got. I got the app installed on the phone now. Um, so that's cool. Uh, did I use the app to update the phone? No, no, I'm, you know, I'm just a teeny wee bit little uh, computer savvy. Uh, I thought the easiest way uh, was I downloaded the uh, the update from Samsung site and they actually have a pretty good tutorial. A picture, 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 picture on every step that you want to do to imply the update. So basically what you do is you just download the zip file to your computer, uh, copy it over to the, the micro SD card and not not the zip file. You're going to you're going to decompress it with the, use an extract on Windows 10 and then copy that folder it's called update the folder's named update oh imagine that and then copy that over to the um, um the sd card and then put the sd card in the camera but while it's off don't don't leave it on and then cut the camera on so there you go um you know and then uh, they were saying you need a special device to charge it i'm just using a regular cord and uh, they say that invalidates the warranty and maybe it does i don't know but I don't know how else to do it. I did want to just go over briefly a couple things I'll be taking along on the trip. Um, you know, the first thing, I, I, I tell you what, I bought this book many years ago. It's the Camping Wilderness Survival, uh, the Ultimate Outdoors book by Paul Tall, T-A-W-R-E-L-L. -L. Um, I'll just show it to you here real quick. Fantastic book. And uh, I always... Sometimes I take it along with me because, you know, when you're out in the forest and uh, you're sitting in a chair and you, you're thinking, well, how did I, how do you tie that knot? 
I can't remember how to tie that knot so that the rope will stay on a tree or, or you know, whatever you want to know. It's all in that book. So, um, you know, and sometimes I just pull it out just for read and just for education. And do I remember it all? No, <laughs> I'm too old and stupid. But uh, so let's uh, just get into a couple things we're going to be taking along on the trip. Um, you know, this is your parachute cord. You know, this is my uh, clothesline, um, which will work if you ever get dry weather, you know, because you can hang up your clothes after hiking and they're all sweaty and nasty. But if you got merino wool, they're not going to stink too bad. I mean, it's the cotton and everything else that's going to stink. But uh, this stuff is great, man. I mean, just for everything. You know, even even for security. I mean, imagine, you know, you you want to uh, if 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 you're in a well, who knows on this trip, right? I mean, the whole world's gone crazy. We've got an authoritarian government. We might have martial law before I get back from, from traveling to Virginia or being up in the National Forest. And that's why I'm taking all this stuff. I want to be able to hole up in the National Forest uh, or, in, or anywhere, you know, in the mountains or wherever I want to go, uh, and, and, you know, in case the stuff hits the fan. I mean, it, it seems like every doggone day we have some incredible revelation. I mean, uh, who would have thought that the... the, the, the Commander of the Defense Department would be a traitor. <laughs> I mean, it's just like every dog on day. I, my mind just gets blown, you know. So anyway, uh, who knows where things are going? <clears throat> Hell, I might be in jail soon. So uh, you know, one of the things, uh, if you know, if you follow my videos, I went up in the Ocala National Forest and uh, did a hike there. And uh, man, those wood ticks! I came back. I, I infested my whole. <laughs> <laughs> my whole house with fleas and ticks and so i bought this uh, flea and tick shampoo i'm just taking it along with me and uh if 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 i do get infested again by doing a hike um i got this you know it's uh so i'll be using that uh we got the snake leggings um you know i i've shown you these lights in the previous video but i just thought i'd show them to you again i mean isn't that great you just pull them out and you got light and uh, I take about I'm going to be taking about four or five of those with me um you know I've, I've talked about uh you know I'd rather weapon up you know and uh but I tell you you know I'm going into some democrat states and the second amendment doesn't mean anything there if you if you just uh study history just a little bit you know Kyle Rittenhouse uh, clear clear case of self-defense um he's been in jail for what almost a year now you know and his trial is pending. Um, I can't see how the prosecution is going to win, but uh, you know, I don't. I don't want to be in jail. So you know, I I try to seek alternatives. Uh, so this is just bear spray uh, made by Frontiers Men. Frontiers Men bear attack deterrent, um, mainly for people. I'm not really worried about the dog on bears, you know. I, although I would want to encounter one. I mean, <laughs> don't get me wrong. <laughs> if it's a grizzly chasing me, you know, I don't know if this will work, you know. But uh, um, but we'll we'll see, you know. But I you know. But if, I think if you hit a person with this, you're gonna you're gonna incapacitate them, and uh, and then hopefully I won't be in jail for a year like Kyle is uh, just for defending himself in a riot situation against Black Lives Matter. Um, those crazy people. Um, so yeah, you know, here's a here's another one. Uh, bought a new compass. Uh, I talked about this in a previous video. This is the S U U N T O Sunto. Um, boy, these come in handy when you're traveling. I mean, because you know, a lot of times, you know, we depend on these cell phones. But where I go, because I'm going to be off grid, I'm hoping maybe hit up into the UP uh, on this trip, uh, all the way up into northern Michigan. So you know, you're looking at. Uh, you know, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000 miles. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going to end up. I just know I've got to get off grid for a little while. So, uh, but, uh, you know, you always want this. And it's for your car as well as uh, your, your backpacking equipment. Um, here's a little uh, crank-powered uh, radio that I'll be taking along. Nice to have. You know, it's solar solar uh, generated. Now, the, the problem with these, and I'm not, I don't recommend them, because uh, at the time I thought it was a good idea because you could crank it and charge up. But I don't even know how to take this thing apart to get the battery out. So eventually these batteries in these devices die and then you end up throwing away the whole damn device. So, and I don't even remember how much I spent for this daggone thing. You know, but it doubles as a flashlight. I hope you can see, you know, so it's, it's good to go, you know. And of course you're going to have your, your bug netting along. Uh, you know, this is a titanium cup. Uh, you, you know, you want to paint it black so that it heats up just slightly faster. But... Uh, um, you know, get the titanium. Um, 
you know, this is a handy little device. Uh, you know, when you get out in the forest, um, you know, sometimes you want a fire, but, uh, you know, what are you going to carry your firewood with you? Which I have done. I mean, you know, it's nice to have, like, if you got some old two by fours or some plywood or, or stuff like that, uh, you know, you, if you can put that like just in a box and just carry it with you, um, I don't have room for it, man. Not, that's one disadvantage of the Toyota Prius Prime because that battery is so big. Uh, which is going to come in handy for all my electronic devices, but it's not convenient for, for packing a ton of stuff. Because, uh, you know, there are vents on there. you got to keep them open uh, on the back seat. Um, but this is just a handy little saw. So I can saw up small small logs. And, uh, you know, it really, I mean, it only takes you about an hour or two to gather wood and uh, saw it up. And, and this, this works perfect, you know. So just something small to carry along. Uh, you know, you've got to have these uh, uh, waterproof bags. Um, so this is just a, just a waterproof bag. So, you know, if you, if you're going to ford a stream or, uh, you know, even if you get caught in a big storm, um, you don't want all your clothes and everything getting wet. So you got to have them in waterproof bags. And, uh, I, you know, I bought this many years ago and uh, I tell you, it's been great. Um, I have a bunch of them and I bought another one that you can tow behind a canoe so that I can, you know, if, if, who knows, maybe I'll get a canoe trip in. That'd be really cool. Wouldn't it? So, um, you know, we don't know, we don't know where everything's going. I'm just kind of showing you stuff that I'm taking along with me, you know, the lights and everything, you know, uh, let's see, what's this here? Oh, this is just some bug juice. You got 100% DEET uh, mosquito repellent, and um, that's what this is, is DEET. Uh, I don't really like using this stuff. I prefer the bug netting, uh, but man, I tell you, if the insects get too, too crazy, sometimes you just got to throw this on the bug netting, and uh and, you know, I'm sure it's not good for your skin, but, uh, you know, at least it'll work. So, I guess that's about it. Uh, um, so, I lost another another whole day messing with this doggone phone. Um, and, you know, what did I find out? Uh, you know, there's just a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton of spying that these apps and everything do. you got to go into each app and, and look at what it's doing and everything. It's a pain in the ass, and I didn't want to do it. But uh, let's do the mantra, freedom! freedom so peace out guys take it easy